Hey, wake up. <laughs> Here, a sandwich for you. Would you like a bacon lettuce sandwich? Hmm. Huh? Hey. Oh, morning. I started living by myself as I entered a college that my parents chose for me. I was fine with that because I had no goals. I still don't. I was spending my days being hypnotized by college teachers' voices and working in the kitchen at a restaurant. My stagnant life changed when I got a mysterious roommate a week ago. I would have killed myself if I had to wash one more plate. Huh? There's someone on the bench. He looks younger than I thought. Is he a high school student? Hey, are you okay? You're soaking wet. You don't have an umbrella? Oh. Oh, what's wrong? Did I startle you? No, um... Everyone else just passed by. You're the only one who talked to me, and I was just... I don't have a home to go to, and I have a favor to ask of you. Huh? He wouldn't tell me where his parents' house is. He got upset when I tried to take him to the police station, so I reluctantly took him to my place and let him stay over. That brings us to the present. I'm still sleepy. Itsuki is a 15-year-old high school student. He told me he had run from home for a reason. His crying face and the fact he refused to go to the police station prevent me from even asking why. It's 10. Your breakfast will be cold. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it looks great. Thanks. Mm, mm. This is really great. Do you cook like this every day? You're great, Ren. Not really. I only make simple meals at home. But you're a high school student. You're in your growth period. I thought I should have you eat a lot. And I work as a chef. Part time, though. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad you found me. You saved my life. <laughs> you're exaggerating. I have no class and work today. Let's go shopping. You don't want to wear my clothes anymore, do you? I'll buy you some new ones. I'm fine with your clothes. Your scent makes me relax. Did you say something? Nope. Clothes and underwear. This is good enough. Sorry I couldn't buy a lot for you. I'm broke. No worries. You let me move in with you. You cook for me. That's good enough. Thank you so much. I'll repay you someday. <laughs> you don't have to. I'm doing this because I want to. Hey, Ren. What's up? Subaru. Hey. Who is he? A friend from college. Okay. Who's this boy? Your little brother? This is Itsuki. Um, he's... I shouldn't tell him that I picked him up in the rain and took him home. My cousin. He's been at my place because of... reasons. Well, he's the little brother I never had. Little brother? Okay. You know, you've changed recently. Really? Yeah. I found it hard to talk to you before. There was this high wall around you. Now you're much more approachable. Maybe it's because of him. Yeah, I think so. I return home from work and open the door, then he'll welcome me. I like that. Oh yeah? Hey, are you making fun of me because I'm single? <laughs> nope. I gotta go. See you at college. Yeah, see you. Sorry for the wait. Ah! Ah! <sighs> What's wrong? Are you upset? I'm not your little brother. I know you're not. Was it the wrong choice to lie to him? No, that's not why I'm upset. You're really oblivious. Huh? Hey, wait! <laughs> Try and catch me! Jeez! <laughs> Ren? Do you regret taking me home? Huh? Why are you asking? You have more things to do because I live with you. And it costs more. <laughs> okay, that's making you worry. No, I'm thankful to you. 
Huh? For what? I was feeling empty inside every day. But it's been really fun since we first met. Like I told my friend during the day. I like it when you welcome me as soon as I come home from college or work. Knowing someone is waiting for me makes me feel secure. So, um, thanks. Run! <sighs> ah. Itsuki, what's wrong? You shouldn't tell me something like that. Unless you want me to stay here forever. <clears throat> and... I want more than being the little brother you never had. <laughs> Just kidding. I've never told you why I ran away from home. No? I was raised by a single father. He's so strict that I'd get grounded for a couple of days if I got one problem wrong on an exam. That's really harsh. Yeah. One day, I ran out of the house without meaning to. And you came back to your senses on that bench. That's right. I don't know how long we can stay together, but you can stay here as long as you want, at least. <laughs> Thank you, Ren. We found him. Okay. Take him home the next time the man goes outside. Got it. It's okay. Don't cause any more trouble. I can't believe you suddenly ran from home and moved in with a stranger. I'll take you home no matter what. He's looked a bit down for the past couple of days. I hope this will help him feel better. It's unlocked. What the hell? Itsuki? Hey! Where did he go? It was ransacked. Something must have happened to him. A robbery? Or a kidnapping? I'll call the police. Hold on, what should I tell them? Worst case scenario, they might get the wrong idea that I kidnapped him. Let go of me! Itsuki? Hey! Ren! Hey, stop! Let go of him! Get away from him! How dare you kidnap my son! Is he Itsuki's father? He ran from you because he's had enough of you. You put so much pressure on him, right? You didn't even know how much he was suffering from you. Don't act like a father. You don't understand anything. My son is going to take over Tachibana Holdings in the future. I need him to learn many things in the best educational environment. What? Tachibana Holdings is one of the biggest companies in the country. They sell medicine, make cars, build houses, and so on. I could tell from Itsuki's behavior that Itsuki is from a prestigious family. But I never thought that his father was the president of a major enterprise. <laughs> Seems like you finally understand the situation. Listen to what I'm about to tell you. I'd turn you into the police for kidnapping my son. But this time, I'll turn a blind eye to you. Instead, don't show your face in front of us ever again. Go back to your usual life. Ren, thanks for everything. It was really fun. Itsuki. Don't come any closer unless you want to get thrown into jail. He's a man of influence, and I'm just a college student. He can easily ruin my life. But... I don't care! <gasps> Run! I can't let it end like this. Itsuki, tell me how you feel. You want to go back to his house? Are you fine with us being separated forever just like this? <gasps> No! Of course no! Dad... I'm sorry. I don't want to go home. Because... <laughs> what the... He's kissing me? I like him. I don't want our relationship to end just like this. Itsuki... You encouraged me, Ren. Thank you. And I like you very much. How do you feel about me? Will you accept my feelings? Or I'm still nothing to you beyond the little brother you never had? <laughs> I always wanted more than that. So I was hurt when you said so to your friend. I want to be your partner. Tell me your answer. Um, I'm... Uh, I like you too. You've changed my life. I would have drifted through life until I died if it weren't for you. I can't imagine a life without you. Really? <laughs> I'm 
glad to hear that. Are you going to choose that man over the family? Dad, I used to respect you when I was little. I wanted to take over your business, but you changed after mom died. You'd let me do nothing else but study. You'd get me grounded if my grades declined. You'd never praise me even if they improved. You're not the father I love anymore. <sighs> I ran away from home because it was painful for me to live with you. I saw your smile for the first time in years. <laughs> I was really bad at studying when I was a kid. It caused me to work harder than everyone else around me after I started my business. I didn't want you to go through what I did, so I was strict with you. But I just ended up making you suffer. I'm really sorry, Itsuki. You too. Ren, right? I'm sorry. Dad... Anyway, I'm so busy working that I hardly come back home, and I'm sure Itsuki wants to live with you from now on too. Do you mind if I ask you to let him stay at your place? Of course, I'm gonna give you financial support. Oh, are you sure? Yeah. Take good care of my son. I can't believe it! Dad, thank you! I can't feel my legs. Well, things settle down, we can keep living together. Yeah, you were really cool when you took my hand. Hey, don't tease me. I didn't. So, we're a couple now, right? Can I kiss you one more time? Oh, wait. Um... <laughs> I like you so much, Ren. Stay beside me forever, okay? <laughs>